Culture is the environment we work in, the values that we live by each day, how we plan our business. It's a feeling. It's touchy-feely stuff. It's not, it's not numbers. People have to feel comfortable in their positions. They have to feel comfortable that they can challenge people around them. They're also expected to grow the people around them. You can't have culture at the top and none at the bottom and vice versa. Everybody's got to be on the same page. If you're a laborer, you got to be able to sit across from me and have the same conversation we're having just as much as one of my managers and feel comfortable doing it and I think we do that. Everybody knows in this company that they can come and chew on me because I'm a Riders fan, right? And that's cool. Or they can pick up the phone and say, I think we're doing something wrong here. They all have access to everybody. The door's always open. Family is the very first thing that they should think about. Work second. It's a really simple thing. It's a really simple equation. It's people and culture and values. And I don't talk about what we do or how we do it. It's those three things. And our clients recognize that too. Sometimes we'll see a superintendent's name on an office because they symbolically have said, we love this guy so much, we want to keep him. I think we grow great people. We attract great people. And you can tell by the number of people that stick around. Our core values are our guideposts moving forward. We're not going to vary off them to change who we are 20 years down the road. They're fundamental guideposts that, that make sure that we stay true to our cause and true to our purpose, right? And, and it's as simple as that.